that's it. Good boy. Hi everybody. Today I want to share some exciting news with you. We got a new puppy. This is Lamy. He is an eight-week-old border collie puppy. He is black tricolor. His register name is Back to Nature Farms Born to Steal the Spotlight. He's been with me for five days now. And the very first time I went to see him, he was four weeks old. It was very important for me that I met his mom and dad because their mom and dad is the reflection of how he will be in the future. So I went to go see him when he was four weeks old and I was able to see his mom and dad as well. When I visited Laramie, Good job! When I went to visit Laramie, I was also able to see all of his siblings and I was able to spend a few hours with his breeder. They compete in dog sports and they were very knowledgeable about the breed and about the dogs. Laramie, come. Good boy. I'm very distracting. <laughs> they would send me videos and pictures of him so I felt like I didn't miss out on his development before he came to my house. And being able to watch him on the video allowed me to learn his play styles and learn a little bit about his personality. Now I want to show you what I got in preparation of welcoming Laramie home. The first thing I got him is this crate. I got this on Facebook Marketplace. I already have a couple crates, but I wanted something smaller to help teach him potty training. And I also wanted a crate that's suitable for tiny puppy. When I have Laramie in his crate, I put blanket over his crate. I have this wood so he can't pull blankets inside. I have been teaching Laramie to go in the crate and to help that I feed him in the crate. So he goes in the crate on his own. Okay. The next thing I got Laramie is puppy food. This is one serving. I put one serving in one Ziploc bag because I use his food to train with him. So if I already measure his serving, I know how much I'm feeding him. And whatever I don't use in the training, I feed him in his crate. This is the mixture of the food the breeder was feeding him and also the food I want to feed him. Laramie's crate. Okay, come. Down. Good. Next are toys. The next thing I got him are toys. I got him two types of toys. The first type is a chew toy. This is a very soft nylon bone. Um, I leave this in his crate so it is always available for him to chew with when he's in his crate. And the other kind of toy I got him is a tug toy. This is something very soft and he really likes it, but he only gets to play with this when he is out of his crate and only when he's interacting with me. The next thing I got in preparation to welcome Laramie is this folder. In this folder, I have my training notebook. I use one page per day. So for example, on December 30th, I practiced all these things with Laramie and I also wrote down that I went to Lowe's with him and he got to see the world outside of this house. And on this side of the folder, I categorized different activities and events for Laramie. So for example, the first one is breeder and I have paper I got from his breeder. The next section is vet and I have agility training folder. 
but we haven't done any agility training yet, so it's empty. And I also subscribe to One Mind Dog's puppy training and agility training program. So I have One Mind Dog section. I have agility seminar section because I hope to attend some seminars with him. And I have AKC agility folder and USDAA agility folder. And on this side, it has more dividers. I only have my YouTube folder and I just have a notebook in here that I write down things I want to talk about, about Laramie's training on my YouTube channel. So that's the folder I got. The next thing I have is my planner. Um, this is not just for Laramie. I use this for work, for my personal use, but I write down his vet appointments. If med any medications do, I write it down. So I think planner is essential. The next things I got Laramie are his collar and leashes. Um, I already had this collar from when I got Kai, so I'm just reusing this. And I also had this leash from when Kai was a puppy. I use this leash as a precaution in case he does not come back, then I have a line that I can reach and then get to him. I cut this handle off because I didn't want this handle to get stuck on something. And we have been playing outside with this on the ground. So this is very wet and dirty. But I also have um, his tug leash. I have not used this yet because we haven't gone anywhere beside Lowe's. But once he learns how to walk on a leash nicely, then I can take him to places and have this tug leash with me. Just like leashes, these are hand-me-down from Kai. I've got Laramie's food in water bowl and a towel. The last thing I use all the time for Laramie is a training vest for me. This vest is very handy because it has three pockets up front, which I can put treats in. I can put my phone. I can put a poop bag in here. And in the back, it has a very large pocket. It goes all the way through. So I can hide his toy in here and he won't even notice that his reward is hidden in my back. I hope you found this video helpful and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! Get it, get it, get it, get it. Film him like this. Uh.